Auditioning is always a challenge for most actors. Hi, my name is Shantria Tram and welcome to WatchMojo.com. Today, I'll be taking you through some tips I have on the audition process, before, during, and after. I know this is very simple, but know your lines. You don't want to get stuck not knowing your lines during an audition. Be prepared. Always read the script or the play if it's available. Workshop it, understand the scene, and treat the scene as a whole play with a beginning, a middle, and an end. Because you never know what they're going to ask you in the audition room. You always want to be prepared. And for yourself, it's better that you know the given circumstances so you can play with the character and play with the script. So, what do you wear to an audition room? It depends. Sometimes uh, they'll ask you to wear something very specific depending on the role that you're going for. But generally, you do want to be comfortable. Uh, you want to be confident because your body is your tool. You want to show your body, but you want to be tasteful at the same time. You want to try to stay neutral because uh, you never know what they're going to ask you to do in the audition room. For the girls, if you have long hair, just try both ways. Try it up, try it down. It depends on how much movement you have in your piece. So see what works for you and just make sure that your face is clear. Be punctual. It's really, really important to get there on time. I usually get there about 30 minutes in advance so that I can prepare myself. It's always good to review your text. Relax your body and your mind. Calm down. Breathe properly. And take the time to awaken your creative self. Become alert and just be present. So right before you go into the audition room, I know this is difficult, but everything that you've learned, everything that you've worked on, just let go of it. Let go of the details and just be present and play and have fun. So now we're in the audition room. What do you do? To stay present and play. What do I mean by that? I mean be in the moment and turn off that critical voice that everybody has. Turn it off so you can go in there, enjoy, and do your job. So when you go in, do you shake the auditioner's hand? Just feel it out. It depends on the context. You'll know when you walk in. What's important is to be yourself. Be confident when you introduce yourself and throughout your monologues, of course. Um, but don't be overconfident because nobody likes to work with egos. When you have the opportunity to ask questions, do so. Ask about when the callbacks are because you want to be prepared if you get called back and also it shows interest and professionalism. If you happen to make a mistake, don't make a big deal out of it. Don't apologize for it, keep going. Um, what I usually do is I repeat the line and if I know the text well enough, the rest will come through, which stresses the importance of knowing your lines. Bring water, trust me, it's really important. You'll never know when you need it. Also, don't be afraid to take your time. We usually go faster in audition settings because we're nervous. Whether you do one, two, or three pieces, step out of the space that you were just in. It shows professionalism. It also gets you to a neutral place when you physically step out of the space. So after the audition, you can usually sense how well you've done. If you don't feel that you've done very well, don't be heartbroken and go out crying. Just learn from the experience. And remember that most of the time they're looking for something very specific, um, uh, a feeling or an essence of a character. So don't take it personally. Persist in training. Training is the key. Um, it's a muscle like any other muscle that you have to keep working. 